guys, what is up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm so happy that you are here and that you clicked on today's video. Today, I am bringing you guys the most intense glow up I think I've ever done on my YouTube channel because guess what? Spring has arrived. Usually, I would wait for the summertime to really go in on like the glow up, but I've been growing my hair out. I usually touch up my highlights every three months, but it's been over four months, so it's very grown out. My hair grows really fast and I have a lot of things coming up in May and June, so I was like, I'm just gonna speed this process up and do a intense glow up video with you guys because I'm going to be just transitioning into my summer self a little bit early this year because you know what? I want to get more use out of her anyways and I'm just ready. I'm more than ready. I just wanted to intro this video because we have a lot of fun things coming. I'm getting my brows laminated tomorrow, which I've never done before, and I'm really excited. I feel like that's gonna be like a game changer for me because I have really bushy eyebrows that I just never know what to do with. So we're getting them threaded and laminated tomorrow as my official step one of this glow up, and I'm really excited. So buckle in, girls. We're going to glow up and transition into our summer slash spring self a little bit early this year. So let's do it officially day one and i just wanted to show you guys we're starting from zero today because my hair super greasy my skin super patchy from my self tanner look at her look at her like that's disgusting look at this arm so patchy oh i hate that my eyebrows are they're rough look at them the up close of the eyebrows are scary so yeah, today is my eyebrow appointment. I'm getting my eyebrows started and laminated and I'm really excited about it. If you guys don't know about the whole process of laminating your brows, I just learned recently that you can't get them wet for 24 hours after you get it done. So that means I have to shower, wash my hair. I'm just gonna exfoliate since I'll already be in the shower. Now, because I can't shower for 24 hours after that and I desperately need to wash my hair, so we're gonna wash our hair right now. When I'm in the shower, I'm going to exfoliate as much as my leftover self tan as I possibly could because later in this video, at some point, we're gonna be putting on a new layer. And I like to start exfoliating like a few days prior so that way I could give myself time to like really get all the excess off. That's what I'm gonna do right now. So that way we're nice and clean for our appointment later. And I'm really excited. I hope I like it. I don't know. This is my first time ever laminating my brows. I'm gonna go in the shower, get myself all clean, and I'll be back. We are on our way to our brow appointment. I'm really excited. I just showered and threw my hair in a little pony. I'm just gonna go get these brows shaped up and laminated. I hope I like it. I don't know, but yay. Hey guys, I just got out of the lamination and I also did threading. You can see I'm like kind of red around because I always get red like that but i think it looks really good it looks so like nice and neat i'm obsessed with it and they look like so full like look the detail i literally needed that so bad i haven't got my eyebrows done i think in years like actually okay guys it's the next day and i'm about to walk into my nail appointment this is literally so long overdue. I'm not even kidding. I cannot look at these nails any longer. I just wait to the very last second with literally everything, including my nails. And I just push it a little too hard, you know? So here's the before. They look kind of questionable. They're just very grown out. I hate when they get super long. So I definitely want to shorten them up. I like them nice and clean and short. I'm going to keep the almond shape. And I think I'm going to go with just a nice clean French because you can never go wrong with that. And I just feel my best when I have French. But I'm deciding if I want to do French with a pink base or with a white base. Because I think I did it with a white base once and I really liked it. I don't know. I think I'm just going to decide last minute when I'm in the chair. Before this, I went to the gym and I showered and I exfoliated. I shaved everything, the whole nine. So now I feel super clean and obviously I look very pale. But I am all ready and prepped to do some self-tan. So I think after the nails, we're going to tackle the self-tan job once we get home. So... That's on the agenda for today. Let's go get this nail appointment over with. Okay guys, just finished. These are the nails. I decided to go for the white fringe, the funny bunny base, and I love it so, so much. They look so nice. Here's a little up close, super clean and fresh. I got them short. 
I'm obsessed. I'm very happy with these. You know when sometimes you like don't love your nails? That's like the worst feeling ever, but I actually really love these. I'm very excited. I'm already feeling so much better. I feel nice and clean and fresh with my short nails. I'm obsessed. Now it is time to go home and I guess self tan. I have to go to dinner tonight for Sam's mom's birthday. So I'm considering either self tanning now or self tanning later tonight. I don't know. We'll figure it out, but we have to go get ready. So let's go home back home time to self tan i decided i'm just gonna do it and get it over with so we're gonna start applying i'm lotioning up the dry parts of my body you guys know the drill i have a lot of different self tanning routines on my youtube channel if you guys want to go watch those like in depth of how i do it but right now i'm just trying to do a quick little application i have my loving tan two hour express in ultra dark this is my favorite ever favorite shade just my go-to when i want it to definitely look good so i'm gonna do my top half first this is the before super pale she hasn't seen the sun in very long um and i'm about to turn into a bronzed goddess okay i'm very excited about this this is like the ultimate transformation i feel like this in the hair just make me feel like a whole new person and i'm extremely excited about it so i'm just gonna start i'll do a little bit on camera but then i'm gonna finish the rest off camera because i like to do it naked so that way i can get the best most even application here we go this is the best thing ever. Okay, one arm is done and you can already see the difference. I'm gonna do the rest of my body and then I'll show you guys what we're looking like. And just like that, it's the next day and I'm all tan. I feel amazing. I don't know if you guys can really tell right now because I'm in this big t-shirt, but this is my tan after I've let it marinate overnight and I also just rinsed it off. So this is like the final, final results. So here is a better look. I look so tan. I'm obsessed and it looks really natural too, which I like. So loving tan just never does me wrong and I'm obsessed with it. But today is the day, girls. Today is the day that we get this hair situated. Look at my growth. It's like actually insane. I always surprise myself with how fast my hair grows. Like it's really crazy. Like this is only, I was trying to calculate it. I think it's about four and a half, closer to five months of growth because I got it done the very first day of January pretty much. I think it was like January 3rd. It's now May 3rd. Oh my God, that's so weird. I didn't even know it was actually May 3rd. So it's been, I think about five months, right? I don't know if I calculated that right. We're going on five months of growth right now, and that's, like, really pretty long for me. I usually do not wait that long, so I'm very excited. I'm, like, itching to be blonde. So that's what we're going to go and do today. We're heading to Long Island. Going to go pay a little visit to Brianna, who does my hair. I'll have all of her, like, information on the screen and in my description. She, like, does amazing work if you guys are in the New York area. Um. So, yeah, we're going to go visit her. And then we're also going to go and just, like, spend the day with Brooke and Brittany since we're going to be, like, in the area and might as well hang out with the girls after I get my hair done. So that's the plan. It's going to be a cute little day. And you guys are going to come along with me. I'm in my pajamas, so I need to get dressed. But I think I'm just going to wear a little grow fit, a fully gray outfit. These gray sweatpants, this gray long sleeve shirt that I got from Skim. Just tried it on and I'm obsessed with it like I feel like I need to get more colors which is dangerous because this shirt was probably like a hundred thousand dollars but I need a scissor but like if I find a shirt that like really fits me good and I feel good in I literally don't care about the price like I need to have it because I just love staple pieces so I'm gonna put this on right now and then I'll be right back here we are I changed two black sweatpants because my gray ones had a stain on it and I just can't be bothered. So we're going for the gray and black little outfit. And then I have a change of clothes with me just in case we want to go to like to dinner later. And I want to like look a bit, a little bit more cute. So I have clothes and my makeup in a bag to bring. Um, but other than that, I think I'm ready to go. So let's hit the road. Maybe we can get a coffee or something because I'm so tired. Okay, let's go get this hair done. All right, girls, Zach is about to get in the car and we're going to go and we're going to be off to Long Island. I think this might be my very last thing that I need to do for this little glow up because I already self tanned, did the nails, my eyebrows. Also update my eyebrow lamination is slaying. I love it so much.
Okay, girls, you guys always ask me what I ask for when I go to the salon, so I'm gonna give you guys the breakdown. We did a full head of baby lights with a thicker money piece, and then I said I wanted a bright beige blonde for the summer. That is the blondest girl I've ever seen. And that's exactly what she gave me. I did what I supposed to. There's nothing left for me to do. So now I'm poking out my head through open windows. Okay guys, here it is, the full reveal. I think I'm completely done with this little glow up. The next day from getting my hair done, and this is like the full results of my hair. I'm obsessed with it, like I swear. I haven't loved my hair this much in so long. Like, it is the exact shade of blonde that I wanted. I feel blonde, like I feel like I just never feel blonde enough, but this time I actually feel blonde. It's nice and bright for the summer and spring. I'm very happy with it, and I love Brianna. She does an amazing job. If you guys are in the New York area, Long Island, go to Brianna. I will have her at down below and you could just like DM her or whatever and you need to make an appointment with her because she is so amazing and has really just saved my hair. So very happy with that. I just did my makeup for the first time with my hair. I feel like the makeup with the tan and everything, my eyebrows, it all just like tied together and I really do feel so much better than I did at the start of this video and I'm so happy. Feel like I'm ready to take on this spring and summer months by storm. Now I have a lot of exciting things coming up that you guys are gonna find out about like literally so soon in the next few weeks. So just stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed already, click that subscribe button. It's a free way to help me out. Yeah, there's really just no better feeling than a fresh blonde. I'm deciding what I wanna do for the rest of the day. I think I'm, I may film a little girl talk video in my car. I don't know yet, but stay tuned for that. I just feel so much more motivated now to actually film and like get some work done and really start off this spring season with all new fun and fresh content so yeah thank you guys so much for coming along with me on this little glow up it's been real it really has been real to get to this final form of the transformation so i hope you guys enjoyed comment down below anything you want we can chat it up in the comments if you guys want to follow my instagram and my tiktok i post on there literally every single day so if you guys want more day-to-day -day content you know where to find me. I will have it on the screen and down below as well. And also, don't forget you can go and shop on my LTK, which is always in my description of like all my favorite things. So if you are ever wondering where I got something, I most likely linked it in my description. And if I didn't, comment down below. Hey girly, give me the link for this, whatever it is, and I will provide it for you. I always try my best to do that, so. Yeah, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for hanging out with me. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.